Hi guys, welcome back to another video about 24 hour streams. Using what I learned from my first 24 hour stream, here is my second take. We'll be going through a lot of tips and tricks that I learned from the two 24 hour streams I did, so definitely stick till the end. To those who are watching and thinking of doing a 24 hour stream, let me know in the comments below where and when. I'd love to come and support. Also, before we get started, smash that like button for good luck. This is the dumpling hat. This will get me through. It will, you know why? Cause I can't wear headphones while using this. Around a week before the stream, I reached out to friends for multiplayer games like Minecraft and Phasmo. A day before the stream, I made sure all the games were set up on OBS in different scenes. Before I only had one scene, and I would hide and show specific source layers whenever I changed games. It's so much easier now, especially with a stream deck, to change scenes with one click. Day of. Drink lots of water. Your throat will thank you. We did just chatting in the beginning. It was one of my sub goals during my subathon, and um, we spent some time deciding what to do with the chat. And they came up with this right here. It was so awesome to say hi to everyone and go through the itinerary. I also made an itinerary command to paste out the itinerary for chat to see. We also played marbles on stream, which was super engaging and competitive. Prizes for marbles can be monetary, such as gift cards, gift subs, and cosmetics from a game. Or not monetary, like channel points, a shout out, or a virtual hug. For dinner, I ate a chicken broccoli bake instead of something super cheesy and milky like last time. And breakfast was some bao buns. Since this was a chat decided 24 hour stream, I played a lot of new games, which was fun for the first 30 minutes, but was pretty draining towards the end. My brain was working overtime to understand the game. And also if it's not a game you enjoy, it's harder to vibe with it and gain energy from it. For example, there was a five hour block during my stream where I had to play horror games. I don't wanna do this. Where were we? Oh my god. Uh... There was Resident Evil 2. Kill everything, run, 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 kill everything. Phasmo. You see it? You don't, you don't see my body? And Little Nightmares. Oh. Uh, okay, I think it's creepy. If you know me, I'm terrible at them. They are way too scary. Yes, I'd rather play 24 hours of Super Auto Pets than this. I would play 48 hours of Super Auto Pets then play Resident Evil. I was dying at the end and was so relieved to switch to something comfortable like League. My tip here would be to plan games you love in between new games, and also during the dead of the night to get you through, or put new games towards the beginning of the itinerary. For breaks, I took a break in between games, so usually around two to three hours. For caffeine, this time I drank a Thai milk tea, and then later a yogurt green tea with lychee jelly. And finally we ended with just chatting. This is a great time to say thank you. Having credits run is a great way to acknowledge everyone who came and supported. Let's do a little video for the very end. Thank you guys for joining me. Bye! I definitely still got tired around 18 hours in. So plan the games that you can play forever here. Also this time around, I didn't actually snack as much as before. I drank a lot more water and the two teas helped with the in the moment energy boost. I'd probably keep it to one tea next time because of how much sugar that was in each. I'm sure it didn't help the sore throat that I got towards the end. I think my throat hurts a little bit just from talking so much. So I've been like chugging water 
every minute. Thank you so much for watching. Once again, let me know in the comments below if you are doing a long-term stream. If you want to see more content like this, drop a like and a sub. Or hop on to one of my streams at twitch.tv slash LCU again. I stream every Monday, Tuesdays, and Thursdays, 5 p.m. Pacific time. And I'll see you again. Bye! My eye circles! It's makeup. The makeup's just getting a little smudgy, you know?